What is up guys, NQ here. If I sound a little funny, it's because I'm a bit sick, I have a stuffy nose. And today's video, I'm just going to explain why I haven't been posting videos. And I'm going to show you guys how to change the size of your Photoshop file. And change the sizes of your images, etc. Um, first off, I haven't been posting because my mic broke. And... Yeah, that's it. So, let's get right into the tutorial. So what I have here is a 1000 by 800 canvas Photoshop file. And this square right here in the middle is 500 by 500 pixels, right? So, um, this tutorial is very simple. You just go to image up here go to image size and right here you want to change it to yeah right here this is your width and your height now this chain here means that it's gonna stay like the ratio is gonna stay the same for example if I wanted it five the width 500 the height's gonna go to 400 as you can see and that's gonna make it half as small it's always going to stay the same. The ratio is always going to stay the same. So I'm going to hit cancel. Matter of fact, I'll do that just to show you guys. And as you can see, the square here is now 250 pixels by 250 pixels. So not only does it shrink your canvas, but it sh also shrinks your image in the middle. So right now, let's say you want a picture for an avatar but your canvas size right here the Photoshop file size is a rectangle and let's say you have this intricate design in, in the middle of it and whatever it's obviously gonna be more than a big black square but I'm just gonna show you guys how to turn the 1000 by 800 into a square in this case it'll be a 800 by 800 or you can turn it into a thousand by a thousand as well I'll, sh I'll show you how to do that as well you go to image canvas size and your width as you can see your width here and your height here so I'm gonna take the width down to 800 and as you can see this anchor point right here um, this dot is what is where your image is so let's say I'm just going to show you guys how it looks when it's in the middle. I'm going to hit OK. It's going to say that it's going to clip some of your canvas because you're taking away 200 pixels of the width. Uh, I already know this. So I'm going to hit Don't Show Again and proceed. And as you can see, it's a square now. And it's 800 by 800. If you go to Image Size, you can hit the 500 hundred like it'll always be a perfect square now I'm going to show you guys how to make it bigger go to image canvas size and just make the height to 1000 and now it's bigger that's a bigger square now let's say let's say most of your image is because if your image let me, let me show you what happens if your image is over here. Image canvas size, I'm going to make it smaller, 800 by 800. And as you can see, my anchor point is in the middle. Let me show you what happens. As you can see, my square was clipped off. Now, if I go to image canvas size and put my anchor point over here, which means that my central point is going to be over here, and I put the width 800. As you can see the arrows are pointing towards the anchor point. Press OK, my square is fine. So that'll pretty much do it for this tutorial guys. I hope you enjoyed, I hope it was informative. And cue out.